The quest for some pricey limited edition footwear spiraled into chaos this morning at a metro area shopping mall. Fox 5's Chris Shaw is live at the mall at Stonecrest in Lithonia with more on what happened. Chris, good afternoon. Good afternoon, Mark. It was a little uh, mayhem at the mall this morning. Most of us probably remember that old Nike commercial with the line, it's the shoes. Well, when you ask the question, why would hundreds of people wait outside for hours for the mall to open? Then you ask the question, why would some of those people then break into the mall because they couldn't stand the wait any longer? Well, the answer is, it's the shoes. It was a mad dash to get inside Stonecrest Mall, and police say it was an illegal one as well. Minutes earlier, about 200 people waited for the mall to open, but the anticipation for the new Nike Air Jordans was just too much for some to take. So instead of waiting for eight for the mall to open, they pried this door open themselves. And people rushing the door, falling. Chaos, people getting locked up, arrested. Giving new meaning to holiday rush. The camp police arrested several people, including this woman, who they say left her children inside her SUV so she could go inside the mall. Cops had to break windows out of the vehicle to get the one and five year olds out safely. Ma'am, were you trying to buy sneakers? No. Why'd you leave them in the car? I was looking for my cousin. Was your cousin trying to buy sneakers? Probably. I don't know. So what's the big deal? Why so much trouble for a pair of $200 shoes? Hey, they're limited edition. See, I got the ones last year and the year before that, so I just have to get these ones. It's the shoe. It's the greatest shoe ever made. It's Jordan. Here's a little update on the, the status of that woman who, who was arrested. Her children are safe. They were given to family members, and they are with them right now. She was arrested. The mother was. Police say it's also possible that there could be additional arrest. They're still looking into the whole break-in that happened earlier this morning. And one other thing to keep in mind, these were limited edition shoes. So of all the people that were waiting outside, actually, some of them walked away with nothing. Reporting live at Stonecrest Mall, Chris Shaw, Fox 5 News. All right, Chris, thank you so much for the update.